Thor has finally arrived in Fortnite. Season four is in two days today to celebrate. Unhook up three people in the comments down below with the season four battle pass. You guys know the drill. Go ahead, drop a like on the video. Subscribe to my channel, turn on notifications, and leave your epic name while tagging a friend in the comments down below. Make sure you comment what is your most favorite part about all the brand new info regarding season four. Are you excited? for the superhero season let me know in the comments down below if you haven't seen last night we got some brand new leaks regarding the brand new season so let me just go ahead and warn you if you don't want anything spoiled i would definitely not watch this video but there's brand new awards brand new skins brand new superhero skins brand new fortnites so much going on guys and obviously in today's video i want to go ahead and get you guys ready I'm excited. There's not really much going on regarding like season three. It's pretty much over. We're pretty much ready for season four. And I know if I'm excited. You guys are probably excited as well. If I find out like any new information, you guys know I'm going to make a video and like keep you guys informed. You know what I'm saying? This first thing doesn't really have much to do with like what's going on regarding Thor and the Brandon rewards. But I just wanted to point this out. I saw it on Twitter and I thought it was pretty cool. This had me thinking if you haven't seen like all the brand new teasers that all the different Fortnite Twitters, Fortnite France, Japan, Brazil, uh, English, all the different Twitters have been tweeting uh, these teasers every single day. And it looks like, as you can see, as of right now on the left, is the English one. We have N-E-X, and I'm predicting that it's going to spell Nexus, and I was thinking, we haven't heard anything about the Nexus since, I'm pretty sure, the, the very first butterfly event with Kevin the Cube. Here's a screenshot on the screen. Obviously, uh, the Nexus is supposedly the main intersection of the bridge located in the in-between in-between is the place obviously in between reality and whatever else that place is it was first shown during the butterfly event after players were sucked into the vortex that the cube opened under loot lake and this vortex obviously led to to, to later be known as the vaults uh, we found out it was under loot lake the whole time none of that matters i just thought it was pretty cool that these teasers might possibly be spelling nexus i don't know i just thought that was really interesting considering all these superheroes are about to like merge into our world like we've already got superheroes in our world but they actually have a reason like they're not just random skins in the game like thor is here hey, let's go ahead talk about that i wanted to wait and see like what exactly was going to happen but uh thor is in the game right now uh if you haven't seen the crater and thor's hammer you you can find it literally on the map at this moment and the comic book has been updated a ton i want to go ahead and go over the comic real quick just to like update you guys on the story and what exactly is going on leading into season four i'm sure you've already seen like exactly how the comic starts pretty much thor gets the uh, power of the cosmics he becomes the god or the herald of thunder uh he has to help galactus find some planets to eat they see this rift in space and they're like oh my goodness that's a rift and galactus is then like i gotta eat it basically they both go through the rift and that's where we're at right here now here's thor going through the rift uh to warn everybody the island close to zero this is what donald mustard was actually talking about when he's saying everybody's getting closer to zero it's just kind of crazy to think that they're bringing this all up out of nowhere he can feel it at once the king of thunder as he soars above this strange and vibrant land something pulling at him trying desperately to work its magics on him to fight through the power cosmic and the odin force running through his god veins then we got this picture of bright bomber and uh kit i'm pretty sure like playing with a butterfly basically it explains how thor is now on the island just like we saw with the hammer and the crater and right here is where things get a little weird okay so i am thor king of asgard i come in peace please tell me what is this place? Where am I? And if we go, wait a minute, to 
three. Please stop this madness and speak. Basically, he's talking about how nobody will speak. Everybody's fighting him right now. Then he's like, why are you fighting me? Why won't you just talk? A great evil is coming and I can feel your land already draining my memories away from me. This is what I was talking about. That one part is exactly what I was talking about. You can see towards the bottom, uh, Thor is literally starting to forget who he is. He goes crashing down. That's where, you know, the hammer makes the crater. It's in the game right now. And then we see that Thor and Bright Bomber have some kind of beef. So, uh, I thought it was important to show you guys the comic because, first off, I wanted to remind you that when you're on the island, not only can you not talk, but you lose your memory. And not only has Thor already started losing his memory, not only has Donald Mustard told us that everything is connected. Think about all the superheroes, Captain America, like th there's a whole list that are already on the island and that have been here for a really long time these guys wouldn't even remember who they are so who is gonna help thor i don't know man i just think that's a whole thing that like nobody's really thought about even in the files right now there's these like weird rune spots that are going to be showing up in game i think it's going to represent a whole bunch of different superheroes spawning in if you guys haven't seen maybe you don't remember we literally saw these in a trailer uh when captain america was actually introduced in fortnite for the first time he literally left this behind uh the little rainbow thing you see at the beginning of the trailer is the rainbow road that's on the first page it's called the bifrost the rainbow road that's on the first page of the comic uh coming from asgard just uh, the rainbow road y'all know what i'm talking about you see it and then you see Captain America obviously leave behind that same spot that I just showed you guys in this image. Uh, maybe it's actually some kind of like landing point for all the new superheroes that are coming to help Thor uh, save Fortnite from Galactus. At least I'm assuming that's what's going on. To even add more to this whole like theory, I mean, it's kind of facts at this point. On the Fortnite website, you can see like in the code these short little sayings kind of teasing different things about the new season here are some right here heralds alone won't save us technology alone won't save us rage alone won't save us justice alone won't save us as you can see these all point towards a different superhero that we'll most likely be seeing in the season four battle pass and there's even more gods or goddesses alone won't save us chaos alone won't say, I thought chaos was kind of weird. Maybe it's referring to chaos as in the chaos that chaos agent has been behind for three seasons now. Uh, I wanted to save this last thing for the end of the video towards the end because I'm not sure if it's true. I just thought it sounded cool, but apparently, and this has been going on all over Twitter all night. People have been saying this is like a real deal leak. Apparently, there will be two battle passes. Both will be 950 V-Bucks, which it's kind of crazy, but it's okay, I guess, because if you buy one, uh, the other one is going to be half price. One is Marvel, one is Fortnite, so one is obviously Marvel skins, and we'll still have another battle pass full of, like, unique Fortnite season skins. And when you reach tier 100 on both battle passes, apparently, you get Spider-Man as, like, a secret outfit. Guys, I think this sounds amazing. Let me know. What you guys think in the comments down below? Do you have any theories? Do you guys have any leaks that uh, you might want to let everybody know about? Comment, drop a like, subscribe if you need a season four battle pass. I'm gonna hop back in the game. I'm trying to finish out this game strong, man. Uh, where's my launch? It's way far away. Do, do y'all have a launch pad, maybe? I'm gonna carry stick pops out. I'm going up to the uh to the zip line. Oh my god, buddy. Oh my god. Ready to oh, launch pad, launch pad, launch pad, launch pad. Is there? I will see y'all later. Uh oh. Oh! Ah! I'm fine. Hit the kid for 24. Points. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? He's right here. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he tried to snipe me. Uh, I'm not sure if he, uh,. Yup, 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 me and Freddy got him. There you go, Freddy! Shake him down, shake him down, shake him down, shake him down! Where is your teammates? Oh. Thank you. Oh, he's in... Uh, 25 on the kid, 25 right. Oh, I got him! 
Let's go! Two in a row, man! 